Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Data Science University with MLV Prasad. The agenda for today's video is Project 2 Panda Sleet Code Easy Question number 0181 Employees Earning More Than Their Managers. You can join the Telegram and LinkedIn community for further updates and discussion. Scan here to join the community links and also the uh, descriptive links will be provided in the chat description below the video description below now let's solve the problem together you can see here they have given a table called employees it is consisting of id name salary manager id you can see here some demo table they have given id name salary and manager id okay now what they are saying employees earning more than their managers okay let me copy this okay let me copy the solution also okay you can see here There is an employee one. His name is Joe. His man his salary is seventy thousand. His manager is three. Who is three? The manager is also an employee in the same company, right? So we can say this manager three is simply this guy, Sam. Similarly, for two eighty thousand Henry, who is the manager? Four. Okay. Who is four? Similarly, he is the employee for himself is max. Let us see for the third and fourth. We can see that both of them don't have managers. So we don't care about them. So we have two things. First employee and the second employee. We can see that first employee manager three. We can see first employee salary is 70,000. He's a manager three. What is his salary? 60,000. Okay. Similarly, second employee, his salary is eighty thousand. Okay. And who is four? Max. What is his salary? Ninety thousand. Now we know what is the employee salary and their respect to manager salary. Okay. But the question is, who are the employees? You can see here. Who are the employees who earn more than their managers? Okay. So clearly. It is clear, right? 70,000 is greater than 60,000, but 80,000 is not greater than 90,000. So only employee one is satisfying this criteria. The name of the employee is Joe. That is why Joe. Okay. So we got the gist. What to do? If you see here, I'm trying to connect this manager ID to the same column in the same table. Okay. It is not possible in SQL. Okay. So what we do, we do something called as a self-join mechanism. It is simply means create a copy of this table, create an alias and connect it. Okay. Let me show you. Let me erase it down. Okay. Let me copy it. Okay. Let me paste it down here. So we can see here now this one Joe seventy thousand Mr. Three should be connected to this three. Am I right? Similarly, two Henry eighty thousand manager four should be connected to these things. Okay. These two things I don't care about them. Okay. So, as we are using the same table name, let me call this table as A. Let me call this table as B. Okay. It is just like a self reference in a copying table. Okay. So, what I am doing, the first table, manager ID, I am connecting to the second table ID. Okay. What? The first table, manager ID, I am connecting to the second table ID. And 
the first table salary should be greater than the second table salary so this is behaving like the original employee table as we are referencing this manager id this is behaving like the manager details okay so what we need to do first create a two copies a and b now we need to connect it which kind of join we need to do if you see only matching rows i care about it all the other things i don't care so i will be doing a inner join between a and b using what the left side manager table the right side id table okay step 1 step 2 step 3 what is the step 4 the left side table salary should be greater than the right side table salary okay let me code it down okay you can see they have taken a function find employees where employee is given as a parameter it is a data frame and the output also should be a data frame okay let me call a equal to a equal to employee similarly b equal to employee okay now let us say um, a table let us say some df is equal to some table such that i need to combine these two tables a dot merge b merge is the keyword for joining two tables as i told you step one is done now what is the step two kind of join what is the kind of join inner join and we have seen here left side we have used manager id similarly right side i will use the keyword write on for id okay now let me return df okay we can see here uh, is it coming just a minute yeah it's coming you can see as it is a inner join it is giving only the two rows you can see the suffixes slash x uh, underscore x and underscore y have been added so in pandas if you do any merging if you duplicate column is there for the left side table underscore x will be added for the right side table underscore y will be added we can uh, create a custom thing as here we don't care about them now what is the condition i need to do here i need to fetch only the which column only the names column where this manager id sorry this is salary x should be greater than this salary by so let me filter it down df where the salary x column is greater than the salary y okay so we have filtered down okay now what we want we don't want the entire table so this is filtering it see this is filtering it but i don't want the entire table i want only the name x column if you see here we are returning a single column called series okay a single column in pandas we call series but what is the output they want to return data frame if you want to return as a data frame you need to give us a list of column names give one add one more thing it will now become a data frame okay we got the answer here but they don't want to call it as name x or name they want to call it as employee okay well let me, let me rename rename use the uh, method sort of attribute columns so dot rename function i'm taking a parameter called column so what does this column do it will give us a input to this such that it will take the old name what is the old name name x what is the new name that should be the value okay now let me run okay it's clear employee jojo now let's me submit that's it we have successfully solved this question hope it's clear for everyone okay now you can see here there is a github uh, repository 
the solution for this video will be provided here you can find the uh, link of this repository in the description below if you are interested in learning data science analytics machine learning nlp computer vision and generative ai please fill in the google form in the description below my team will be contacting you and for further updates follow my official linkedin page for the channel that the link also will be provided in the description below and if you have any further questions or doubts regarding this question please use the hashtag ask prasad and you can drop your question in the comment section okay until then keep learning guys never give up